Hi guys, now you are going to learn about alternating current and voltage. Okay, first of all, alternating current. What is alternating current? Alternating current is that which keeps on changing its magnitude and direction, which keeps on changing its magnitude and direction for a particular period of time. That is called alternating current. Okay. Generally, how can we produce the alternating current? We can produce the alternating current by using alternators. Okay. By making the coil to rotate, by making the conductor or coil to rotate in a stationary magnetic field. Okay, rotate in a stationary magnetic field, we can produce alternating nature of voltage. Okay, so by using the principle of electromagnetic induction, we can produce alternating nature of voltage. Okay, generally we will represent the alternating nature of current like this. This is the waveform which we use to represent the alternating nature of current. Okay, it is a sine wave. We will use sine wave to represent the alternating nature of current. Okay. And this is the point which shows the magnitude of current. That is IM. So, along this axis, this is I. Okay. And <clears throat> this indicates the time period. And this cycle is a this is called a positive cycle, positive cycle and this one is called negative cycle, negative cycle. Okay, if this waveform is having a total time period T, then up to this point, you can say the time period is T by 2. Okay, so up to this point, we can say the time period is T by 4. Okay. Similarly, alternating voltage is also changes its magnitude and direction for a particular period of time. Changes its magnitude and direction for a particular period of time. It's called alternating voltage. In general, how can we produce the alternating voltage? With the help of alternators with the help of alternators simply by making the conductor to rotate in a stationary magnetic field we can produce the alternating nature of voltage okay and in general the alternating nature of voltage it generates like this okay so this represents the alternating voltage and current both are one and the same we use it to represent these two things with the help of sine wave. So here, this is this will this peak will shows that magnitude, the maximum amplitude of the voltage, V maximum. Okay, and remaining all the things are same. And next thing is instantaneous value of current and voltage. So instantaneous value of current and voltage in the sense, see here the instantaneous, instantaneous in the sense at any particular instant of time. Okay, the value of current or voltage in an AC circuit at any instant of time is called instantaneous value. Okay, so if you want to find the current at this particular instant of time, at this particular instant, we can define by instantaneous value of current or voltage. Okay, so uh, represent I by I m sin omega t. I m sin omega t. Or we can represent uh, this one like this. I is equal to I m sin omega t plus phi. Where omega t plus phi is the phase. Omega t plus phi is called phase. Where phi is the phase difference. Okay. Where phi is the phase difference. 
similarly similarly we can represent the alternating nature of voltage v is equal to vm sin omega t sin omega t where vm is the maximum value of voltage or we can represent v is equal to vm sin omega t plus phi sin omega t plus phi here omega t plus phi is the phase and phi is the phase difference phi is the phase difference so the basic thing why we are go, uh, going for alternating nature of current is basically the thing is the cost of generation is less for alternating current the generation cost is very less in case of alternating current see here cost of generation is less that is the reason why we are moving on to alternating nature of current okay and it can be easily converted from one form to another form okay so this is only the uh, energy which we can convert into which we can convert into any form of energy any form of energy okay so ac is available in wide range of voltage levels wide range of voltage levels in general 220 to 440 440 11 kv 11 kv 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 like that wide range of voltage levels are available okay this is about alternating nature of current and voltage thank you